So this would be one of the ones where the camera faces forward and shoots out. This is Duke Riley, and this is his posse of smugglers. So what happened? These pigeons just showed up one day in your loft in Key West carrying cigars? That may or may not have been what happened, yeah. It would appear from the, the video footage that uh, these pigeons uh, have been uh, flying from Havana to Key West with Cohiba cigars. I'm Elena Rizek, a reporter with the New York Times. We visited Duke, a Brooklyn artist, in a studio in Gowanus to get a peek at his latest project. It's called Trading with the Enemy, and for it, he spent eight months secretly training a flock of homing pigeons to fly from Havana to Key West, Florida, carrying illicit Cuban cigars. For this project, I started with uh, 50 pigeons that I began training, uh, and it's sort of a process of elimination. Some of them just you get lost or don't make it back. Half were meant to smuggle cohibas. The rest carried small cameras to capture the journey. What you're seeing here is a pigeon's eye view of Havana. One took a rest on a party boat somewhere in the Gulf of Mexico. When it was detected, it caused a little bit of alarm. Uh, Mel Gibson is not in here. Oh, Roman um, Polanski? But Roman Polanski is. Pablo Escobar? Yeah. The birds Pablo. were named after famous smugglers, and the ones with cameras were named after directors who've had trouble with the law. Uh, this one uh, is kind of a bully, actually, so it's kind of fitting <laughs> no, that his name is pa Pablo Escobar. He, he sort of. Uh, yeah, he kind of picks on all the other birds. To be clear, Duke Riley didn't smuggle the cigars. That would be illegal. Right, yeah, pigeons have a mind I, their I, own. I've not encouraged any, any animal to uh, take part in anything uh, illegal myself. What am I doing? I guess I'm, I'm doing something uh, pretty dumb and dangerous. But Duke is no stranger to illegal activity for the sake of art. In 2007, he was arrested for floating his homemade submarine too close to the Queen Mary II. Anyone to do something like this has to be really stupid. To promote trading with the enemy, Duke took to the streets of Brooklyn late one night. As part of the exhibit, the pigeons will be on view and for sale at a Chelsea gallery this winter. That is, if the law doesn't get to them first. Do the pigeons have lawyers? Um, if they if they have they haven't you know they haven't spoken to me directly about it but uh, you know naturally I think that they're, maybe their lawyers are advising them not to at this point in time or yeah they're trying to stay quiet sure sure yeah yeah, yeah I don't well, blame I'll them see. yeah.